Well, from Vegas back here to the natural state, those Hog fans are out and about tonight. Not only is it a busy night for the Razorbacks, it's a big night for business across Central Arkansas, especially bars and restaurants. TV 11's Jalissa Garza joins us with a closer look at just how tonight's game is so good for business. Well, Craig of Faith, we've talked about how the Razorbacks making it to the Sweet 16 was sweet for business, and that's definitely proven tonight as people gather across the city, including right here at Dugan's, to watch tonight's game. Businesses I talked with today told me that another Razorback game means another big night for them. Literally hog wild in here. Another Razorback game means another busy night for businesses. We will have everything stocked up by the time the hog starts. Brewski's Pub and Grub says they expect to be busier than they were the last two games and have been working all day to prepare for the crowd they expect. Obviously prepping more food. We're opening both floors. Um, we've already got plenty of reservations. Manager Kyla Harvey says reservations aren't common for a Thursday night. Most people come out to make reservations for like birthdays, celebrations, but we've got some serious hog fans here. While Skinny Jays and Argenta is not taking reservations for the game, their phones are ringing nonstop as well. A normal Thursday night would just be chill, we're hanging out, we have a good crowd, but tonight we are expecting people to come out in droves. We've been getting phone calls since 1030 this morning. General Manager Hannah Bowles says sporting events like March Madness are a big deal for the business. One where your local home team is participating and doing so well, I mean, you, you can't ask for a better situation than that. And they hope to double the profit they normally would on a Thursday night. The further we progress, the bigger crowds we expect. And again, we've got the space and we can't wait to have folks come out. Razorback fans are making their way to Dugan's right now and they expect for it to be another busy Thursday night for them. Don't forget, tip-off is at 615 right here on THV 11. In downtown Little Rock, Jalissa Garza, THV 11 News.